we're just gonna get to see how it plays out right here. Uh, so Samus bans FD. Uh, maybe Battlefield? Because she kind of nerfs her recovery. Okay. Fountain gets banned because it's good for that. That makes a little bit of sense. I didn't see what entirely went down. But, uh, yeah, they're going Battlefield. Okay. So my initial prediction was correct. All right, let's let's get it on. So Samus, of course, likes to say very grounded, but this is it's very tricky uh, in this matchup because you know, she likes to say grounded, but there's uh, lasers, and when you're very grounded, you don't have that many options to deal with lasers. You have to do a lot of power shielding or wave dashing out of shield, which you're going to be seeing a lot of, not just because of Samus, but also because of. Samus. I don't agree with that down throw. I think uh, Falco's better option there with Falco is to up throw and attempt to catch him on the way down. Man. Okay, that's a good, that's a good rising throw. On the guy. Now I do know on this stage, uh, Samus can do the, the the double missile, but I'm pretty sure it's really tiny because I've tried, I tried to do it for like an hour. Okay. Definitely not gonna get that hard. I like that he went for the tech chase on the top back. Uh, he could have uh, done that better, put himself in a position where he could have reacted to the tech by jumping below the platform and hovering there and then jumping in the direction of the tech. Okay, good solid charge. Uh, let's see how he uses this charge shot. Is he gonna use it while recovering? Oh. Uh, look at that. It's uh, interesting. I've seen a lot of uh, Miss Tech and Get Up attacks from Seppi. Now, get Up attack is OP though, so it's definitely it definitely seems to be working. So. Oh, he got punished for a roll. So, that was a good run up here. Oh shit, caught him slipping on the ledge. That shot is very scary. Should have shielded. Definitely should have shielded. Oh, oh, I like that. That was cool. I expected just a straight back air follow up. He went for the tech chase on the platform. I like that. I'm stealing that. Thank you, sir. Nice up, you. Really, I mean, I don't really know this specific matchup too well, but it seems like Sebi is uh, in the air quite a lot. Probably a, a bit more than Samus should be. I imagine, because uh, when, when I say like duck play, even in this matchup, he's still pretty grounded and just use like a lot of shield. I, I suspect that Seppi's shield game isn't uh, that, you know, good enough to the point where he can just be dumb. Alright, that's game one. As expected. Uh, pretty, I don't want to say commanding, but definitely convincing that he knows, he knows what's going on here in this Falco matchup. Yeah. Oh, my co-commentator actually decides to join me. Uh, well, I really don't okay, know what to do. say. He started both games with an immediate rising fair onto the platform. All right. That's sick. Uh, a lot of players, I, I don't feel like a lot of players think about, like, the best way to open games up. But I do. I, I, do, do, I've, do I've thought, I, I mean, I've just thought, like, Okay, based on like my spawn position, what's like the optimal thing to do right as like the game starts? And I think I, I don't know if a lot of players like look into that specifically. Because, I don't know how Samus do that. Like the sweet spot with the fucking gravel so well. I'm always super slow when I try and do that as Samus. Yes, okay. Here we're definitely uh we're seeing a lot more grounded play than Samus. Oh my god, he's getting so many grabs. Stop doing so many lagging moves on the shield, please, Felco. Okay, try and... Oh, they're gonna try and double jump sweet spot ledge. Does that mean I'll have aerial interrupt? Yes. 
see some aerial interrupt on his shenanigans. Okay, nice. Nice now. Okay, yeah, falling. Back, oh. I would have rising back right there. That probably, a bat rising back right almost probably. I'd say it's, yeah, that was like, pretty much going ahead. That was a shitty sound. I don't know how esports this stream is. I'd imagine I could swear a little bit. Oh, that's unfortunate. I hate Doggo. Oh, I, I think he did a right. Falling near there, right? We just pissed him that upper. Nice wave dash back. Okay, I like this. Nice power shield. I didn't do anything. Sam's Dare isn't really that good of a coming down. Probably have done there instead or bombed again. Oh, that was super sick. That was nice. That was nice. That bomb jump there. Okay. Alright, nice way back for the next switch. Nice. There. Falling. Okay. That was, yeah, that was very close. Falco really contesting Sebi on the platforms that much. Oh. I know what he was trying to do. And it was super sick, but uh. Oh, nice charge shot. Tech chase? Falling there. Okay. I wanted to be cool in the pineapple and falling there. So good. Oh my god, that crap! You're nuts, Sebi. Oh? Oh, he had the read, he just didn't space it right. Sebi's getting so many grabs. I mean, I think most of it is just due to the Falco uh, not doing what he should entirely. But you know but what the... It's still good on Sebi's part. Do you know what the cash prize is? The cash prize? Yeah. Like how much people win for winning this event? Yeah. I do not know. Oh, okay. I mean, there's close to, uh, I think there's like 50 entrants almost, isn't there, right? Uh, almost 50 to 60, so if it's 10 to 10 a piece, small, I mean, multiply that and use the payout structure. Definitely getting a good wad of cash for winning this oh, yeah. But uh, anyways, good good shit to Sebi. Uh, he has definitely has a sick Samus. I love good Samus. Good job, Big Nutty. You did, did good really try, good. Good try, Big Nutty. I have to go play my pool. I felt, uh, felt kind of good in the beginning. Right, Big Nutty, we're going to do some commentating. Some real commentating, though. Yeah. Because uh, this guy was only talking trash about you. Kind of oh. 